Hey guys, Sock here from Sock e Tech, and in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to transfer all your contacts from your Android smartphone to your iPhone. So if I go to my phone over here, as you can see, I have three actual contacts. You can ignore these two. This is just my local profile, and this is just a group, so just ignore these two. But I do have three contacts. As you can see at the bottom, it says three contacts with phone numbers. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take all these contacts I'm going to transfer them over to this phone, the iPhone, and they're going to show up right over here. Now, just to be clear, this method is going to work for any number of contacts. So I'm just using three for demonstration, but you can in fact use five, 10, 20, 100, 500, or even a thousand or more contacts from Android to the iPhone using this method. This method is 100% free and it's very efficient and it's only going to take you one minute. And of course, the only requirement is the phone that you're transferring from to the phone that you're transferring to. And of course, a PC or a Mac. You do not need to download apps. You do not need to pay any money. It's 100% free. So let me show you how to get it done. Now, real quick, I need you to understand that all these contacts over here are in fact backed up to my Google account. And that's how you do it with Android smartphones. With the iPhone, all your contacts are in fact backed into iCloud. So the key to this transfer is just to transfer my contacts from Google account to the, to the iCloud, which I'm gonna do in a second. But before we do that, I wanna make sure that you guys do one thing on your Android smartphone. So I have three contacts here. What I want you guys to do is go to the settings of your Android smartphone and it's gonna look a little bit different than this phone over here because you may have a different manufacturer. So all you wanna do is you wanna to go to the accounts section of the settings and then just look for accounts and just find the Google account that you're using on your Android smartphone. So in my case, this is the Google account that I'm using right now to sync all my information from my phone to my Google account. So tap on it and then tap on the sync account and make sure that contacts are in fact being synced to your Google account. And that's all you have to do with the smartphone. Now, after you make sure that this is enabled, all you have to do is go to your computer and log into Google. Let me show you how to get that done and transfer the contacts. And they're gonna magically appear right over here via iCloud. So after you move over to your PC or your Mac, all I want you guys to do is launch any browser that you want and then go to contacts, okay, dot google.com. That's all you gotta do. Now click enter and it's gonna ask you to sign in to your Gmail account, just log right in. Now in my case, mine logged in automatically. But as you can see, the three contacts that I had on my phone are showing up right over here because they're in fact synced to this Gmail account. So to transfer these contacts, all you wanna do is just hover over one of the contacts and select the contact that you want to transfer over. And then over here on the top, you can tap on that arrow down button and just choose all contacts. So you can actually selectively choose or unchoose the contacts that you do want to transfer over. In my case, I'm gonna transfer all these three contacts. So I just went over here and did all, and that's gonna select all the contacts. Next, what you wanna do is you wanna click on this uh, button here, the three buttons over here, just click on it and click on export. Once you click on export, you're gonna get this uh, box over here. And at the bottom of this box, is, it says that uh, you wanna export this as V card for iOS contacts. So iOS is Apple. So you want to choose this and you want to make sure this is uh, set to selected contacts and then simply click export. So once you click this, a file is going to download as you just saw at the bottom over here and it's going to be named as contacts. This file will go into your downloads folder. So let me bring up my downloads folder. It's right over here, the file that just downloaded. So now what you want to do is go back to your browser and just go to iCloud.com, okay? So iCloud.com. And again, it's gonna ask you to log into iCloud and just make sure that you log into iCloud. Once you're here, you're gonna see this dashboard, click on contacts. And now what we have here is, we have all the contacts that are currently on my iPhone, which as you know, is nothing because my contacts on my iPhone were completely empty. So what I wanna do is now to import the file that I just exported from the Google site. So all you wanna do is come to this button at the bottom here, the actions menu button, click on it and click on import V card. So we're gonna click on that and then we're gonna to go to my downloads folder on my PC right over here 
and here's the contacts.vcf file. You click on it, you click open, and boom, all three are gonna show up right here. And you're done with your computer. Now let's move on to my iPhone. Just click one button on the iPhone and all these uh, contacts are magically gonna appear on my iPhone. All right, so on your iPhone, all you wanna do is this. Just go home real quick, go to the settings, scroll down to where it says uh, passwords and accounts, just tap on it and then go into your iCloud account, tap on it, and make sure the contacts button here is in fact enabled. Just click on that. Now I'm gonna go back home, launch my phone, and boom, those three contacts that were invisible just appeared here, and they're the exact same replicas of these three contacts. So that's all you do to transfer contacts from Android to the iPhone. So if I click on this contact here, or this contact here, you're gonna get the same exact information as you can see, all right? Just remember the key concept is the contacts on your Android smartphone get synced into your Gmail slash Google account, and the contacts on your iPhone are synced back to your iCloud account, and all you have to do is transfer from Google to iCloud, and boom, you're done. If you do have any questions, comments, or concerns, just drop them down below. For now, guys, have a fantastic day. All right, so if you found this video useful, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech by clicking that button and also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Saki Tech Online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.